Shike. Hey guys, how's it going? I hope you're all keeping well and happy this week. Let's have a quick chat about these rods from Rohima. So anybody who doesn't know Rohima, they're a German company. They make drumsticks, uh, drum brushes, drum rods, among other things. But this particular product that we're looking at here is the Rohima Professional Rods. I bought these back in 2019. I've been using them ever since, so I thought I'd do a review on them. So in length, you're talking 415 millimeters. That's about 16 inches and the diameter of the rod is about 15 millimeters. Overall, that comes in at a 5B. So that may or may not suit you. One thing to mention though is just down here where the rubber handle is, that's gonna have a couple of mil added on as extra just because of the thickness of the handle. And I'm only talking about maybe two mil in total, but it's something that you need to know. Also just down here in the midway point where we have this, uh, extra piece here for stability that's made of the same material as the handle we'll talk about both of them in a minute now in total the makeup of this stick is that it's made up with 19 bamboo sticks i would describe this stick as being very flexible So like I was saying, these are quite flexible and I think that that is a huge influence and a massive difference in the sound. For instance, if you've ever played these rods and they've been quite stiff, you get a lot of the top head, but very little of the bottom head. Now, if they're quite flexible, what happens is when you hit in, you cover a little bit more surface area of that top skin and then that kind of activates the bottom skin and that's the same with the snare. You're gonna activate more of that snare wire. However, there are these movable rings that you can move from the bottom all the way up to the tip if you want a bit more of a stiffer stick. So you have that option if you wanna go for that kind of sound and feel. Now, speaking of feel, let's talk about the handle. So if you've ever played one with a cheap um, handle that's gonna be a bit more of a plastic feel, it can be a real nightmare because you can dig into the hands. This isn't like that. Like I was saying before, it's a rubber handle. Um, I've never really had a problem. It's quite soft and never been uncomfortable in the hand. I wouldn't use these for every song on the set list, obviously, but since 2019, I use them sporadically. For the first dance is the more quieter song and they've held up really, really well. No chips on any of the bamboo. Pretty much held up just as well, if not better, than the more well-known brands such as like Vic Verth or Promark. And they come in a little bit cheaper at roughly around 15 bucks. So if you're in the market for buying some rods and you see these, definitely give them a look because they're well worth it. Now, remember guys, that the opinions you hear are mine and mine alone. No money exchanged hands for this review. The company see it the exact same time that you do if they see it at all. Anyway, I hope this helped. If it did, let me know down in the comments section. If you're still here, give me one of these and subscribe if you haven't already. Take it easy, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Guys, hit me up on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And if you like what you're seeing here today, you can see a lot more videos. Just click on any of them here on the screen.